Hello everyone and thanks for stopping by and checking out this video. This is um, two journals that I did <clears throat> right at Christmas time and um, I think that um, maybe not everyone got to see it. Um, there wasn't a lot of activity on either the journal or on my uh, Big Cartel website. So what I'm going to do is just quickly go through these and um, I'm going to link the actual flip through for you so you can see it, you know, page by page. So this is the Midnight Meadow and it's the one I did in collaboration with Tanya and um, at Taddy Treasures and Collage Type. And um, it's a typical size. It's eight and a half by five and a half and the spine is three quarters of an inch. This is the one I used that really old book cover. I just love that old book cover and then um, I added this um, very dark teal color in with um, the journal covers or journal um, decor because it you know we picked up some of these colors but anyway I'm not going to run through it but it is a family history type journal doesn't have to be uh, for your fam you know, family history, but that's kind of what I had in mind. So, like I said, I'm just going to do a little quick flip. Um, all the pages in here for journaling. Lots of journal cards and tags, all the goodies. I like to do a lot of that stuff. So that's, um, these are so cool. These are from my, um, these are from the kit, I believe, that one. And this is from a, um, a book that I received with the <coughs> black and white illustrations. I'm sorry, I haven't talked much yet today. Uh, this is a clipped on um, notebook and there's pockets on both sides that holding a journal card which I love that one some lace border more journal cards more tags pockets uh, this one opens up like this I think okay that opens up like that and then the journal cards are inside here I couldn't remember exactly what I was making. So that goes there. And um, more pages. A lot of stuff in here. This is uh, another uh, journal writing space. It closes like this and then folds down like that. And there's a journal card in here. And lots of journal space. Lots of empty space for journaling. And this is your writing board. And um, it's flat so you can use it in between your pages that might be bulky. If you're writing, like if you're writing on this side, which you, well you could write back there. But you put this in there and that keeps it nice and firm. I put a tab on it so you don't lose it because I lose mine all the time. And then this is the back cover. Okay. And then it just ties shut with this um, kind of a bronzy sari silk. Just a little skinny one. And then with that I have this little packet of that I use to hold on my ephemera during the uh, videos um, and I'm, I just put the leftovers in this packet and so you guys can add more if you'd like. Alright, this one here is uh, Family History Your Story and um, this on the front, well let me untie this. This is um, not sorry silk, this is a chiffon fa uh, fabric that I got on a roll. Uh, this is a little um, frame and this card is stuck in here. You may have to have a tweezer or something to get it out but anyway it you can pull this out and put your own photograph in it and you can set that 
here on the front of your journal. You could glue it in if you wanted to. I didn't because this is cross stitch. Oh, darn fly keeps coming back. This is cross stitch and I stitched this myself and used it in this journal. And um, this is an altered book, by the way. Um, I put this little jewel here. If you're not into jewels, I just never get a chance to use these, especially this one with this color. And, um, you know, you could take it off if you'd like. And I don't have a problem with that. So as, this is an altar book, like I said. So uh, we have pockets. It's not the kind where you fold the paper down. I covered the whole paper and I glued them. Let me see, I think I glued the pages together to give stability, but I did not make pockets um, out of all of them. So here is a pocket that I put in that one. Um, journaling space, here's a pocket here. I think I did fold this one down when I first started. Um, these are all flips that go on the sides. And there's a flip inside the page. Here's, um, I guess, just a pocket on that. This is a little notebook. You just or you can rip off these papers and use them in, um, you know, for uh, collages or something. Uh, this is a um, copy of a passport from 19, uh, oh my gosh, I forgot. Hmm. I think it's 19, oh wait a minute, I left this open, 1922. Um, and he was 62 when he got this passport, so he was um, born quite a few years ago, I think 1980-something. Um, here's a little uh, flip here, and there's a pocket. All of these photographs can be removed in here. Let me show you. Let me get my tweezer a little bit in case I didn't make that aware in the other video. You see, all these come out, and you can put your own photographs if you want to leave these in, you can. This is my great grandmother. This is my great grandfather. And um, there's some more flips here. Oh, there's space for a journal card, which, oh yeah, I did. There it is. A journal card in here. And he comes out. They all come out. Okay, and then here's a writing page. This um, here lifts up and there's a journal card inside of there. And then I've got this little pocket out here with all kinds of stuff. This is a journal card which you can pull this out again and put your own family photo. Okay. Uh, this one here also comes out. You can journal on the back of that or you can... Um, this is an envelope just for you to put some notes or something in. Okay. I know I didn't want to take forever. Like I said, all of these are available to change out. There's a journal card in here. Some vintage paper. CD cover. More writing. More um, journaling space in that pocket. And that is the end. And this is the writing board uh, for this journal. Okay? So, um, I guess I'll just put it that way. So all my journals usually come with a, a writing board. Now these are all listed on uh, Big Cartel, and I'll leave that link uh, in the description. And um, I will link the actual videos of me um, showing these flip throughs. But like I said, I think it was Christmas time, and I really felt like you know people were busy and they just and then you forget about it because you know that video is not going to pop up anymore for 
you know, some time. Uh, this is just a little pocket here with some of the leftover um, stuff. So, you know, if you want to add any more into your journal, you could. All right, so I guess that's it. I, um, I hope this wasn't annoying that I went through these again, but, you know, there are a lot of num uh, new subscribers, and if they haven't seen it, then they'll, they'll get their chance to see it, too. All right, thanks. Talk to you later. Bye.